Hey everybody, so testing out this game, a demo of Kainga, Seeds of Civilization. It's another game that I wanted to play from a long time, just based on how beautiful it looks, the artwork especially. Uh, I have no idea what the game is about. I know it's, I mean, well, it's a civilization building game, but I don't know what the gameplay is going to be like. Uh, the I just launched the demo and it put me right in in uh, smack in the middle of the game. No idea what's going on, I press the menu, hit recording and back into the game. So let's go into setting, uh, wow, I, lo I love uh, the drum sounds that you have here when you go over the menu. I'm gonna reduce the master volume a little bit so that my voice doesn't get uh, submerged under that. Uh, let's put everything to high. Why not? Uh, window right. Looks good. Love the menu. Love the menu. It looks absolutely gorgeous. But hopefully the game is equally good. Uh, the reason I launched this game is because it's a Steam, a Steam sale going on and it's at a good price. I haven't checked the review because generally I, when, you, when I start a game like this, I want to make my own uh, opinion about the game. So re unless, you know, one of my friends or someone who plays games tells me to check out a game. But otherwise, I generally go in blind. Uh, Play it for some time and then check the review. Uh, well, not for AAA games though, because they're very expensive. So for AAA games, I do check the review sometimes. So let's go in. Welcome to Kainga. Let's let the basic of Kainga together. First things first, let's move the camera around, okay? Man, this looks gorgeous. I love the color choice, the pa the the pastel looking colors how you can see your objective in the right corner of the screen oh okay so you're asking me to move the camera this way right cool rotating camera QE can I not rotate with okay I can rotate with this zooming uh, use mouse wheel to zoom click mouse to click mouse wheel to move the camera freely okay you have Tink tinker? Okay, it's tinker. Mm, tinker kind of thing. Tinker. Uh, sounds like a character from Gloomhaven or something. Anyway, click here to find your tinker. The blue bar also shows your health. Why do I have health? I mean, is uh, maybe people attack? Okay. Uh, great. Build a campfire. Let's next. Let's build a campfire. Sure. Campfire will be the center of your town. Okay. Click the campfire button at the bottom. Alright, there we go. Oh, okay, okay. So this is like uh, uh, the town hall or the, the, the main building in, you know, in Age of Mythology, Age of Empires I used to play. Anyway, so cool. Let's, let me put that over there. Oh, these are villagers. Oh, it's so, okay. So this is almost like uh, Age of Empires, Age of, you know, that that's the Age of Empires, Age of Mythology, and there's one more, um, Reign of Techno. Oh shit, Reign of Empire. I think these are the only games that I've played with uh, Civilization. I've never played uh, Sid Meier's Civilization. Hmm. But I have played uh, the old ones, Pharaoh, Cleopatra, uh, Caesar. Anyway. The campfire is in the center of your town and where your people will stand idle. Selecting campfire will show you a current relation with your neighbors. So oh, that's why we have health. Let's take a look at some of the buttons around the screen. Sure. Resource claimed. Uh, okay. So food, clay, food, clay, uh, logs, bamboo. Oh yeah, that's right. There's ba there is bamboo. Uh, this is bam. I, I failed to notice that when I uh, when I was adjusting the sound earlier. All right, understood. This shows upcoming weather event to prepare for. I can't. I can barely see it. Uh, move more. Most of information. The name and icon of whatever your mouse is. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Cool. Total population. Okay. Braves are your basic units that can do most action. So these are braves. How? They are able to manage tasks on their own, but you can also force them to do actions. Brave are basic. Okay. Oh. Commanding units. Left click uh, to select someone and right click to command them. Go cut a tree, dude. 
Oh, you don't? Shiny more. Left click to select summon and use right click. Okay, if you hold control, uh, oh, if you hold down control while commanding, you can force certain actions like chopping down a tree. Sure, let's do this. Try to force a brave to chop her resources. Well, he's not doing it. Uh, normally, when campfire has been built, I, I, your tinker, will think of some house types to choose. What? When I have an idea, click the exclamation mark over my head to choose a technology. Show me. Okay. Return home. Round houses with reed roofs. Uh, sturdy houses. Isolated out of houses. Okay, what's the difference? Protected from all those weather, so we have to watch out for weather. Uh, return houses, construction, protection. Okay, it, I mean takes uh, capacity four what's the difference between okay the one is larger diamond shape okay i think i need to be uh, mindful of the placement uh, the space when i build okay what do, what can i build let's build a return home a return home build a home to produce more people of course to produce people you need home they won't do it in the wild out there in the wild while everyone is watching <coughs> Anyway, new technology get added to the hot bar. New technology get added to the hot bar. What's hot bar? Ah, here, okay. Click the new house button to start placing some houses. Oh, that was just a technology. I didn't build the houses. Can I rotate it with Q and R? No. Oh, it cannot be outside. It has to be close to the campfire. Okay, let's put it a nice view. Okay, they automatically go and do it. These characters look so cute. And this game looks absolutely gorgeous. Oh, it's raining. Oh. Wait, what? It's a single cloud that's pouring water on people. It's <laughs> That's hilarious, okay. Anyway. Uh, my tinker. Get in the house. Get in the house. Oh, maybe that's just a representation of rain. I mean, it, probably the, it's raining everywhere, but like just so that it doesn't uh, obstruct our view. They have it like this. Uh, right. What is that? Who is that? More than what is that? Oh, these are my neighbors. They're this close to me. Wow. Oh. Okay, build a house, uh, build a few houses. Okay, I need more houses. So I'm gonna bu build it around here. Build one around here. All of them should have good view. Maybe not this one. This one will have uh, light obstructed from this side, but that's view right there. Can I build more campfire? No. Can I? No. Oh, if I select the campfire, it shows, uh, what does it show? Relationship. Akiyote. Cautious. Oh. Where is the other, other civilization? I don't see it, but anyhow. Whoa, what is this flying over there? Look at the bird. Something from Avatar just entered the Kainga universe. Dude. Right, now what am I supposed to do? Build a few houses, okay? So I have to wait. Press uh, rotate. Oh, so R is to rotate the building. Right, so I'm gonna do one more. Inspiration. Houses need a foot to operate. You get more technology. To get more technology, we need to find source of inspiration. I thought necessity is the mother of invention anyway. Uh, inspiration will give a tinker an idea for new technology. Do you see that beam of light? Which one? Which one, dude? Show me. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, select your tinker to see inspiration more clearly and send send me there with oh it's about food okay hey here, here he's thinking he's thinking about turkey and chicken <laughs> that's a funny way to create technology 
you go and muse over it. Mm. Manula. Such a gorgeous game. Foom. All right. Tinker has thought up food. So let's build the technology. Bakery. Ah, okay, this way. Bake crow, crop row, paddy, bakery. I mean, I can't. I cannot build these two, I believe. Why is there a warning? Shit, I saw a warning. I didn't read it. Reliable and consistent bakeries. Bakes in edible reeds. Into, I can't read for shit. Uh, build a bakery on the house to produce food. Own a house. Placing attachment. Attachment snaps to the side or backs of houses. House, houses with attachment will no longer produce grapes. Oh, so be sure to have some normal houses too. Got it. This is like Agricola. Uh, if you if you guys have played the board game Agricola, it's similar. You have a house and then you start attaching and making the house bigger and bigger. And uh, feed your people and sh stuff. So let me build a bakery right there. Man, this would be a beautiful house if one existed like this, overlooking the sea and there's a bakery. Build a bakery on the house, doing that. How do I check how much resources I have? I have uh, 10 wood, okay. No clay, yep, I know. We don't have uh, resources to need to build a bakery, we need clay. What can we do? I think I saw some clay down by the water, show me. Oh, it shines like this again. He needs to think up the clay resource. Resource within the circle will be used by your braves. Resource within what circle? Uh, I'm not sure what that what they meant by that. Anyway, Tinker, go think about clay, dude. Uh, click the claim land banner and place one down by the shore. One by the shore, which shore? Which shore do you want to want me to place this? Fusca, we need to build that. Okay, clay pit. Endlessly produce clay one at a time. Oof, that's slow. Maybe I can develop technology later on. But let's go clay pit. Uh, after every few technologies, your tinker will return to the campfire to think of a festival. Okay, a festival will come up when you hit the question mark. Each hit each question mark in the technology bar. All right. Too many things going on at once. Let me finish one thing. Every challenge will be complete with a specific as well. That's how you win. The goal of the tutorial is to complete any festival. Okay, got it. That's interesting. That's really interesting. Uh, does it need to be attached to a house as well? The goal of the tutorial is... Okay, okay, got it. Think at the inspiration of the campfire. Oh, wait a minute. Let me just place this goddamn clay pit. Hey guys, how do I place this? Yo, wait, I think I have to read. Produces placed on a fertile soil and... Or does it need... What does it need to be built? Uh, it doesn't show me what I need to pay to build this. So I'm trying to place this, it's not working anywhere. Anyway, I'm not sure how it works. I'm just gonna go forward, it's weird. Okay, dude, gather your festival inspiration. Um. While he's thinking about the festival, uh, let me see what I can do. No food. A 
festival that grows bamboo in abundance. Feel free to build a festival whenever you like. Just do it. I mean, it, the game is really not letting me do anything much, so I don't even know how to place a clay. Oh, wait a minute. I think, I think I know. Oh, no? Okay, no, no. Place, I, I thought you have to place it next to the bakery. Place on a fertile soil. Huh. What is, what consi constitutes a fertile soil? I, I don't know. Hmm. No idea what to do. I mean, I'm just doing the festival without me doing anything much, so... Festival is complete. If I'm not mistaken, this festival will summon a mighty crustacean to carry me to... what? Okay. Then my trials to prove myself as a tinker will complete. Will be complete. How's the festival? Let's get out of here. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, it's no different from what I thought initially. Uh, uh, right. So, what am I supposed to do to host the festival? Uh, a festival that grows bamboo. Pop four or what is going on? Host the festival? How? I mean, do I need to build more houses? Maybe? I don't know. Hey, I see something over here. So that means that's for clay pit. Right? What? Oh! How did a clay pit... I have no idea what's happening anyway. Oops! We don't have enough people. Build more houses and produce more food. Dude, to produce more food I need clay. I don't know how to put clay. You haven't given me a break. Where are the dudes? Come here. Build this shit. No, 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 no. is getting built what I'm not sure how I did that oh god all right hold on give me a sec this clay pit now and why am I not able to build a house oh I can build a house here okay let's do that in a beautiful place to have a house right next to edge of the map no it's not edge of the map <laughs> from, from Fusca I wonder if it's a made up language or one actually that exists in real world. I'm in love with the colors of this game. It's just absolutely gorgeous to look at the choice of colors. The game itself, I'm not really sure yet. I need to play a little more because I'm really not understood the placement, how to control these people, uh, these workers. Uh, they're calling them Braves, and 
there are some differences actually quite a lot of differences even though it feels familiar okay they're, they're producing clay uh, food no food there is one food but I mean there's one bakery that's why so I need to build more houses and have multiple bakeries I believe there's just no space to build houses can you go here, here, here? No. Okay, I'm just gonna build one here. Construction material. Ah, it costs reed to build. Okay, okay. Got it, got it, got it. Right. All right, so there are two more houses that I'm building. I have only four people. And in one of them, I'm gonna put a bakery because uh, people need food, man. Speaking of food, I'm fucking hungry, but I'm gonna finish this demo first. Boom. Beautiful looking game. I think I already said that, but... Yeah, every time I look at the colors. What are these guys? These guys look like they're having a party over here. Are they like my um, rival gang? Look at that, they have a jar. And I don't know what do you call this, an arm. Um, that dude is hammering away at the plateau. And what is this? No idea. Okay, so I got one more person. Five. Somebody build the bakery, goddammit. Where is everybody? Yo. Where is everyone? I don't see my people running around like these guys over here. Yeah, there's one building over here, but there should be four people. It says zero. Uh, oh, okay. Come here. Come here, build, build the shit. How do I command them to build? Oh my goodness, I'm not sure how to... I'm holding down control, but they're not really taking command. Okay, he's doing it. Now he's doing it for some reason. There's one dude who's idle. Come here, do it. Dude. Okay, there's another bakery. Yo. I have no idea what's going on. I don't know how to give them commands, that's one thing. It said hold control and then you can change, uh, you can give the Braves command because they'll generally work automatically. No reeds? Well, I don't see any reeds here. There's one over here, but I don't know how to reach that. Mm, no food. These guys are eating faster than I can produce and there's one idol over here. Well, it says zero idol, but I'm not sure how that works. Can you, can you get this somehow? I don't know if you can. <laughs> no, you can't. Okay, there we go. Where is he taking the read? Okay, he just put it over there. Okay. Somehow, in some small way, it reminds me of Caesar, where you don't really have uh, control over the citizens and where they go, and you just build buildings and manage resources. So it's more like a resource management and also where you place your buildings, because uh, I think the uh, when you when you're playing as Rome, uh, Carthago attacks you in that game, if I remember correctly. I'm not sure, but anyway, the. Um, 
seems like that in this one at least you can control the citizen partially but honestly i'm i haven't been able to give them any commands nice music pushka what do you guys need food food is a problem right now there's enough clay so maybe i'll build one more bakery what do you say you guys should be happy with that This old man is standing here, Tinker. Yo, Pushka, dude, don't stand there. Come here. And do we have read? We have one read. So that's the limit. That's the limit. I mean, I guess we can't build more houses. Hey, but can't we build different houses? Like if I hold control? No. So what about the other technology, the other houses? Mm, material, clay, resources, tinker. Oh, there are multiple tinkers, I see. Tech. Try this technology in game, but how do I do that? I mean, did I miss the tutorial which said how to do that? Tutorial. Pop required. What's pop? What's pop? Ooh. Swap to bonfire. What does that mean? No, no idea. Why don't I see other houses though, like the ones they had given me option or maybe I have to select from the given option like at that point of time, what technology do you want for your people? So when it comes to this question mark, maybe I can choose again. Oh, pop is population. That's what pop means. Okay, let's host the festival. Come on guys, everybody. Yeah, get together. Party, party time. Oh my goodness, what's happening? What? The fuck? Okay, that was unexpected. <laughs> oh, the people are happy, so I guess that's good. <laughs> the sounds they're making. Anyway. Oh, yeah, I'm happy too. Did not expect that, but cool. Completed the tutorial. Thank you. Let's see. Let's see if I can do something myself in the next one. Left click. Oh. Okay. What is this, man? Your tinker. He can read. Uh, here you can read about your tinker's information and choose your team color. Nice. Let's go radiant. Nice green, because I always play green when I play board games, so let's go with green. Uh, except, what if you go here? Nothing. Start your first challenge at the map, at, uh, at the map at the back of the room. So probably this one. Interesting, the game is quite different in many ways. Okay, so, there is a uh, woodland landmark. I don't know what that means. Frill barrage. Uh, lush cliffside downwards. And this one is uh, lush cliffside do uh, drop downwards towards the ocean. In this resource abundant region, different elevation bring different challenges and space limitation. Okay, cool. Uh, oh, so these are. Oh, these are different buildings I can build here, I think. The flatlands, it's locked, it's locked, it's locked, it's locked. Okay, so I have choice from the flatlands and the terraces, cool. Wild and open land with scattered oas, o o I never pronounce oasis correctly. Anyway, 
With a scattered OSS here and there, uh, finding a protected area can be challenging as, fi uh, as finding the resource. No, I don't want to make it tough because I still don't know how to play the game. So let's do this. Karma shop, what's that? Okay, embark. Uh, so this guy is the one who leads his people, I believe. Woo, god damn, he came down hard. Anyway, so let's build a campfire somewhere nice. Somewhere where I have a lot of... Oh, what are these people? I think these are my rival. Okay. There are already people here. What the fuck? Yo, what is that? Shit. So I shouldn't be that far. I think I'll uh, build under this Sakura tree. I don't think I want to go too far. <laughs> but I'm very close to these these men over here. Oh, he got an inspiration. Ah, there we go. So now I can select whatever. So this one requires bamboo, reeds, and logs. Capacity for what? What's the advantage of this though? Because this one requires only two read protection from all this no attachment only two population okay return house will give you that return house mm, food producers what's the main difference isolated population what uh, spawn speed increases increased 50 percent when built far from neighbors okay so this has a advantage uh, Braves get rain hats so they can still work during rain. So let's do this. Let's do this. I don't see rain up here, but let's do it anyway. All right, that's the technology we're going with. Going to build some houses and we have no space for it. How oh, cool. All the houses should face the lake over here or the ocean. Is this a lake? Because there's lotus on... I haven't seen lotus on, uh, on, on, on in the sea. Has to be like cool what's a keyboard shortcut for this i think i remember in age of mythology it used to be e to build houses hey dude there is an inspiration for you right there tinker oops right there we go yeah he's gonna think it up and oh shit there is something here what the fuck is that man some kind of weird lochness monster come back. Oh, whoa, whoa, it's coming towards. Oh, yo, go away. Shit. Oh, there is something here as well. Oh, the giant snails. That's why the health matters, I, I believe. And then you have this shit here. It's a beautiful creature, but. Probably dangerous. Silk loom, uh, slow but reliable, produces silk fabric. Grow a farm of reeds. Yeah, I need reed, stone miner, mine shaft directly. I don't need, I don't need um, bricks right now. Maybe I need, I don't know. I hope I, he gets the inspiration again. Reject all, choose passive, reroll at the cost of karma. Oh wow, so it's like random resource I have to make do with it. I think I need reeds right now because that's what I'm building the house with. Uh, grow a reed farm. Reeds cannot be eaten but are used for construction and production. Friska! Uh, don't have space to build houses, man. So, Friska, why don't you come and cut the wood here? Yeah. Oh, okay. So I think if my tinker dies, then the game is over. So I don't, I don't want to send uh, send him to his death right now. To what? Gucci. <laughs> Oishi. Yeah. It's quite different from other civilization games. I mean, it has similarities, that's why I thought it is going to play out like uh, Age of Mythology or something. Don't cut the Sakura tree, cut everything else but the Sakura tree. Uh, that's a Sakura tree, I believe. No, cut this one, dude. Holy fuck. Hey, yo, that Lochness shelled thing came over, but it's not attacking me, so that's good. 
do you have another inspiration here? Whoa, what are these things, man? Is it peaceful or what? Like, it's like a snake with a shell. It's an insect, it's a snake. Some kind of weird invertebrate. Okay, oh, rain. But you guys can still work. Hey, there's no reed, so that is not good. Yo, do one thing, come here. Ah, that's not my Fusca. A trade route has been proposed. A neighboring tribe is offering to do a trade route. Select the table or click the notification to locate it. Trading back and forth will improve relationship. Always. Always have business with different communities so you don't other them. That's a good thing to do in, in games as well as in real life. Funny rain, okay. Here we go, bakery uh, produces four food and produces one food. Fuck off, I'll go with this. Uh, farm row can be placed on fertile grass. Got it. Fruska, uh, are you my guy? Yeah, you're green, right? Can you? Get, get that read before these guys, those uh, blue guys see it. We have established trade relation, they shouldn't mind. Kuchi! Oh yo, dude! Yeah, yeah, come here, come here! Inspiration gained. Snail Beckon. A festival to call a snail from wild and tame it. Broad walk. Oh, I'm supposed to do this. Uh, a round wooden area for two people to fight to do what? Okay. Okay, <laughs> and here I thought it's a peaceful, peace-loving people, but uh, apparently not. Humans are humans, whether they are in or outside games. Uh, right. Okay, let's see how this plays out. I'm not really sure where it's gonna go. And this guy is standing idle over here. Yo, 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 yo. yo. Go get the reader. And I don't have clay. I think this requires clay. Yep. But I have six for now, so I'm gonna place a reed farm. See, this is my problem. I don't know where to place it. Okay, the, ah, it has to be inside the circle, that's why. But it's so close to the bonfire. It looks ugly, like everything close by. What is this thing doing? farm and uh, we still have some reeds to collect so why don't you go here collect reeds whoa what is that they have like air balloon wow Something there was a sound wah not sure what it was. Oh, so these guys are harmless. They didn't attack anyone and as long as you don't attack any uh, attack them I guess. Let's yo dude, 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 dude don't stand there idle. Let's go collect your reed. Right here. It's okay, the neighbors don't mind. We have trade relation with them. Are you going? Yep, yep, he's running. He's running. And you sir. There's twenty-two this is reed field, okay? Cool, cool, cool. Let's build a construction material is reed. So let's build a farm. Oof, the sound of rotation is is quite aggressive. There we go. I 
have only four population because these fuckers haven't built the houses yet. Fuck, it's gonna take some time. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pause the video, let it go forward, and then unpause it. Okay, the game has some notification, I don't know what world and anti increased over time uh, slowly and when land is claimed higher anti will increase the severity of Kainga's events I don't know idea what events uh, is gonna transpire but let's see is rain considered an event probably not dude you guys don't have fucking reeds it's so annoying man when oh you're farming okay Yo, Froska. What is he doing? Why is he inside? Come here. Oh, man. These guys don't listen to you. Which is annoying. I don't like how they're automated and they choose what is necessary for the civilization anyway. A demand has been made. A neighboring tribe is demanding something. Select the demand table or click notification to see what they want. Uh, from there you can accept or deny. Understood. What do they want? Oh, here. Fuck, okay. So, are our relationship good now? Uh, okay, I can select the campfire to see. Kala Jira. Kala and Jira. <laughs> Charunska. Okay, cool, cool. Sumak's town center, so I'm called Sumak. Right. Oh, there's a watch. There's a dude who is on a watchtower. Dude, what are you looking at? Is there like pirates or someone who comes from there? Oh, maybe you're fishing. Oh, okay. What is he doing? He's doing something, but I'm not sure what is he doing. <laughs> oh, there's an inspiration here. Uh, brother Sumak, come over here. And. Do, do, do you fucker? Listen to me. Come here. Get the reeds. First of all, neighbors asking reed. I have to uh, give them that. On top of that, we need houses. Yo, what is this? Return house build. Good, good, good. Gucci. Right. <laughs> no Gucci for you if you don't <laughs> fucking build the houses and collect reeds. <laughs> the way they speak and the way they move. What, 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 what? Yo, 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 leave me alone, man. Come here. Come here. Come all the way here. I want to know what is that. No, he's not going to listen, of course. Paddy Bakery. I already have Paddy. Oh, no, I don't have Paddy, but I have Bakery. So I'm going to put Bakery. I mean, what am I saying? I don't have either. Uh, so, more way to get food. Yo, 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 old man is running back. Yeah. Dude, come over here. Oh. Uh, can you build a campfire? Only one campfire is allowed. Banners claim land and resources and are free to build, but increase the world's ante and can make your neighbors upset. Oh, fuck off, there doesn't have neighbors here. Build, build a damn banner. Put the banner down. That is ours. I want to know what is this. It's like an abandoned settlement or something. Get over 20 braves in your village, host an arena festival. Mm -hmm. And kill them. Optional objective. The enchanted red tree from... Uh, protect the red tree from arm. Well, I'll try. Sakura. No food. Of course there's no food. How many population do I have? I have 11. There are three idle motherfuckers. Come here. Collect the fucking weed. And you build a goddamn house. Here. Oh, you, you, you. where are they running off to? Assholes. So, they're like children. It's so hard to control them. Come here. Go here. Fucker. Nice music. What is this? Uh, structure safety. 
Return huts, okay. Shut the fuck up and build those houses. Quickly. What is that? What is that sound? What is that sound? Are neighbors upset? Oh no, they want something from me. Do I have stuff? Yes, accept. Take it, take it, dude. We're brothers in arms. Or without arms. I don't want to go into arms right now. I'm still learning the game. There's an inspiration there. Dude, old man. There's an ins inspiration next to this beautiful looking creature. So, oh, that's an engineering inspiration. Go, go, go. Fiora's game. Okay, a lot of things going on. The dude went to take inspiration from there. He got the inspiration. Watchtower demand table. A table to make demands of your enemies. Oof. Storage. Hmm. I'm gonna go with storage. And then dude, come over here. Right? These are getting built. Okay, guys, I'll be back in just a second. I'm gonna pause the game for a moment. Okay, let's chug along. Mm -hmm. Look <laughs> at the way the cloud came in. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Two idle, where are they? Can I not get to the idle? Come here, idle fuckers. There's no food, man. Alright, let's build this. Overlook the lake. No reed. There's one idol. Come and cut the fucking reed. Kainga sounds like. Kalinga. Kalinga was this. Um, I don't know. If it's not a civilization, but it, it was an area in the Mauryan during the Mauryan uh, rule, Mauryan dynasty rule in the Indian subcontinent. Oh, trade route. Okay, what do you want? Whoa, this shit. What is that? Beautiful though. They need food. Deny. Fuck off, I don't have it. Don't attack me, please. What's my pop? 15, okay. <clears throat> My houses and oh wait, I can already do this, but I just need 15 population, <clears throat> and I need space to do it. Shit. Okay, so I need more space. Let's do it over here. <clears throat> No food, I know. These people fucking eat like there's no tomorrow. There's weed lying around over here. Uh, crow pro, right. Can I put it here? No, it has to be inside the circle. That's a kind of, that's a bit of a limitation to be honest, if you ask me. All right, there we go. Whoa, what's up? Banner complete. Right, and we have our arena. Whoa, what? Oh, the snails attack you. Shit. Shit, Alright, guys, run away, run away. I don't think we can take that. Whoa, what the hell? Okay, I need to complete this level fast. Stop attacking the goddamn snail, hey, but it's making everything green. 
by puking on it. Huh. Yay, we have food. Dude, don't have the food lying around. What the hell? No, no. Yeah, that. Shit, everything is submerged in the water. It's not going well for me. <clears throat> Didn't expect the water to come on the shore where I was. Okay, it's done, I guess. No. Done? Okay. Build this, build this quickly. Quickly, let's come in the festival. And I have 11 people, so four of them died. And this is now submerged. Fuck. Dude, the water is just coming up. <coughs> oh, it receded, okay. Farm. Wait, what happened to the Kenny's 20 population? I don't know how to get to 20 population. These people are not producing babies. I have enough food now, I guess. Reed is 21. Twin. Okay, I have enough resources, so that's good. build this also if you want what's happening what's happening god this thing always scares me combat what 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 where where you're under attack by who oh this fucking snail dude can you not build a wall around the snail and anyway probably not It's gonna build houses here just in case the other houses <clears throat> get submerged or get destroyed. I have enough read. But not, not enough people. A shop opened. What shop? Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Uh. Route stopped, return house bill, shop opened. What do you do with the shop though? To <laughs> I hate games where you, they don't let you experiment and you have to go exactly like they uh, planned it. You know what I mean? Like, let me experiment, let me click on stuff, let me make mistakes, but uh, apparently, no. I'm not complaining, I mean, this is a different game, I can't expect all the games to be the same, but. Is, whoa, dude, don't go there. That snail is a pain. Come here. Just, just, just fucking build this house. Just don't go anywhere. Just build that fucking house and just stay there. Yeah, Fusca. So, population 14, not bad. No reeds. There is plenty of reed here. Come here. Clean land under the circle with brave, uh, dude. That's just annoying. Why do these people go automatically attack? I just, it's so fucking frustrating. Fuck off! I don't need to build anything there. I need to delete this banner as well. Claim this land. Come on, go, 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 go. There's this weird looking creature right above the hill where my shop is. 
What is that? Low poly, some weird looking dinosaur bug thingy again. It's a weird island we are on, so maybe it's Pandora. Hey, what is that? Die pot. Pushka, can you take this for me? Without getting attacked. Take that, take that, come on. Yeah, that's right. Perfect. Banner complete. Collect the weed, yes. <clears throat> I'll build a storehouse for you here. Okay, I have food. Uh, accept. Hmm. Okay, that's what it means. Oh, crazy rain. My goodness, look at the cloud. God damn, the water is gonna come up now, right? Yeah, that's why the water level increased because of the bloody rain. But because of return houses, these guys can work in rain, so it's fine. Okay, there's enough reed now, so why don't you build the houses? They are doing that. That's good, that's good. Food is... What? <laughs> hello, hello. <laughs> They're speaking one art, you know? <laughs> oh wow hey guys 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 get over here get over here get over here get over here just ignore that place just that place is cursed oh did you kill the snail no get over here Get over here. Get over there. No need to build anything. What is this? There's a dude over here or what? Wait, who is that? Who the fuck is this? Hmm. Look at this guy. How did you even get up there, man? Fuck, go die. Demands met. Demands met. Okay. No food. I know. These fucking farm takes forever to get built. Mm, we have enough reed. That, that creature's sound is unsettling anyway. Let's have a bakery build as well. Just in case. Okay. I'm gonna pause again and come back when there's a little more progress right took a dinner break and here we are back at it again so where was I oh yeah making these people grow their population oh what the fuck oh it's attacking I mean it's attacking my neighbors my friends oh whoa, whoa, whoa. what the fuck is happening Oh, they started the festival here. Challenge at risk. Why should I care? I mean, it's someone else doing it. Is it like who does it first? Probably that is what it is about. Like I have to rush before my... Hey, I have it built here. Before... Uh my opponents do it no that is these guys my whoa my goodness another village hosted the arena before you could yeah that's what it is so you are ra you're racing to organize a festival and that's how you do it cool all right i'm gonna stop it here it's a nice game really like it but i don't think i'm gonna get it right now uh, I want to play it a little more and see the intricacies because I'm really irritated with the fact that you can't really control the citizens. Probably it's part of the puzzle where let them do what they like. You know, you have to give them task in such a way that they will get things done uh, in a certain order, so that uh, you don't have to worry about micromanaging them. Because I'm so used to micromanaging them in RTS games. But anyway, uh, it's a different game. Beautiful looking. Not something that I'm uh, keen on, but I'm still going to continue playing this demo and see how it goes from there. Right. Bye-bye.